Here we are talking about NMOD once again. That's environmental modification, ladies and gentlemen. Everyone has noticed, and all the people I've met are remarking about the odd trends in weather. Um, this is because the government has taken upon itself to melt the ice caps. This is something that they've wanted to do for quite some time. Uh, there are probably are benefits to that as far as planetary maintenance are concerned, but basically they justify it because there's a lot of gold and oil underneath the ice and real estate. And of course, that's what gets them all charged up and make, and motivates them to do anything at all. Otherwise, you can just forget it. The world could just go to hell in a handbasket. And if, because if there's no money in it, people like the Bush family and the Clintons and all the rest of them bury uh, are not going to even worry about it. Arnold, Arnold, he's a big money boy. He loves his money, and they think they're better because they have it and other people don't, and that's because they're so small inside. They have to be that way. They can't uh, justify their existence in any other way than taking more than their share, and they don't do anything out of goodness or because it's right. They only do it for money. Now, a lot of the lines being sprayed in the sky are ground heaters. A lot of the plasmas that form afterwards are ground heaters. This uh, was used initially to melt the ice and to re-divert uh, or divert the jet streams. This is all about uh, melting the ice and moving the water out of the oceans across the land to remediate the attack the Russians did on us with TMT technology back in the 50s and 60s and also to keep uh, the levels of the ocean at manageable um, levels because uh, otherwise it would flood the seacoast badly once those ice caps were melted. Um, they bring the cold northern air down and heat it and this is uh, why they need the ground heaters and now that the chemtrailing has been exposed and people are starting to look up they know that it's not good for people so they've had to slow way down on the chemtrailing so what we have is ultra cold weather happening because they've diverted the jet stream so to bring this cold air down across land where they can then heat it with the uh, further chemtrailing other than the chemtrailing up north which is just melting the ice then in the summer that's when they do the work to divert the jet streams they use the ground heaters to cause great updrafts and it's it's actually an engine of air movement that uh, they are building I have pictures out west where they were conditioning certain lines and streams um, that had not existed before or had existed in other forms and they were diverting them and uh, maintaining them in April of every year I got I have pictures across I think about six years maybe five years but the same exact spraying in the sky um, right in the middle of April to the west of Hachita where I lived um, the same patterns the same monstrous uh, sizes to these things hooked grids and all at the same time of year then i have the same uh i have patterns manifesting at different times of the year as well across the different parts of the sky in the west and this all points to a long-term uh conditioning of the atmosphere bill richardson ex-doe uh head under the clinton administration he not only uh, was overseeing a lot of this stuff. He was doing experiments and using energy technology on his political foes and just about anybody that didn't go along with him or uh, really bowed down to him. He just used this. Uh, he's the worst case scenario. He's a, a Latin godlet, you know, thinking that he can get away with these things, hurting people this way without them knowing. But he's been exposed through my book, Devil Vision, and he's out of the picture now. Um, all this stuff about carbon in the atmosphere and carbon sequestration and things like that, those are all lies and just ways to try to keep a world currency here and to grow a world currency in the United States. And none of that has anything to do, you know, the NMOD technology is remediation for that too as far as catalyzing agents 
are concerned in chemical reactions across a broad area, square miles, and whole states, whole countries. So this is uh, the, the lies tripped them up because not only did they lie uh, in order to try to rip us off more and keep us under their taxation thumb, they denied that any of this is going on while people were able to look up in the sky and see that it was going on. So, you know, there is justice. You just have to look for it.